Welcome back. If you've been feeling anxious and stressed throughout this pandemic and honestly, who hasn't? Well, this week's your best life is for all of us. We're exploring tapping, also known as the emotional freedom technique to find out how it can alleviate anxiety, depression and negative patterns with just the tap of your fingertips. The emotional freedom technique, also known as EFT or tapping, is a holistic treatment used to decrease physical pain and emotional distress. The combined principle of Chinese acupressure and also um, the modern talk therapy. Angela Collier is a licensed yes, professional counselor in Waco who offers EFT her. to her clients. She says she's seen amazing results. Tapping helps us tune into different patterns, negative patterns and of thoughts and feelings and emotions. Tapping involves just that, tapping on different parts of the body to rebalance energy and relax. Collier says anyone can benefit from it. Our bodies give off electromagnetic fields and sometimes they get out of alignment, especially when we're feeling down, sad, blue, or in pain. And so the tapping actually uh, taps along the meridian lines to help us um, get it realigned. According to Collier, it's especially great for anyone suffering from anxiety, depression, stress, phobias, chronic pain, ADHD, even low self-esteem. She uses it on herself daily. I especially like to use it at the end of a long day. There are two portions to EFT, the actual tapping and then the repeated phrase you use to reprogram your brain. Collier teaches her clients to tap on nine acupressure points, the top of the head, above the eyebrow, at the temple, under the eye, under the nose, at the chin, where your collarbone meets, under your armpit, and then on the karate chop point, which is the fleshy part of your palm. Now you can do it on either side of your head and neck, and you only need to tap hard enough so that you feel it. Then that second part is the repeated phrase. Collier uses two short phrases, and she says you can input any problem you're experiencing. And the phrase is, even though I used to have anxiety, I deeply love and care for myself. So where I placed anxiety, you can place anything in there. And that's the long one that you start off with when you're tapping the top of your head. And the second phrase is just a shorter one. I used to have anxiety. And we use that phrase all the way down on the rest of them. Collier says keeping it simple means you can use tapping wherever you are, whenever you need it. So if you're interested in trying it out for yourself, Collier says you can easily find videos for free online. Thanks to platforms like YouTube, and Pinterest. And it has expanded. More and more people are offering it because it works. Now I've been using tapping techniques for more than a year to help with my own anxiety and racing thoughts and I have included some links to a few of my favorite tapping videos over on YouTube along with this story on our website that is kcentv.com.